Hey guys, it is Monday, September 13th, 2010. I'm John Balicki, and this is an AMD video. Now, I've got some information. I am going to say take this with a grain of salt, but apparently um, I have come across some news about socket AM3 Plus and bulldozer and uh, CPU slash motherboard compatibility. Now, what it turns out is that bulldozer CPUs will likely not be uh, compatible with socket AM3 motherboards. However, apparently what you will be able to do, now again a grain of salt, you will be able to buy a socket AM3 Plus motherboard then drop in your AM3, uh, regular socket AM3 CPU, and then later on get a, get a bulldozer CPU, which would actually be the better choice if you think about it. Because I give you an example: my X3720 was literally the very first uh, batch of AM3 CPUs that they came out with, um, and. Uh, yes, I have an unlocked core on that, and I'm running it as an X4, but the problem is it just does not OC past 3.1 gigahertz very much. I, can, I just cannot get to 3.2 reliable. doesn't matter how much voltage I throw at it, not happening. Um, is the system capable? Do I get playable frame rates in all my games? Yeah, yes I do. So, you know, so again, this is grain of salt stuff, so if you are if you have a socket AM3 system, or you're, if you have a socket AM2 or AM2 Plus, then just hold on a little bit longer until Bulldozer comes out, and then you guys could get uh, both the CPU and the motherboard. Because when I went from socket 939 straight to socket AM3, I did not want to, and I, I had purchased two gigs of DDR1, and then the AMD, AMD's like, okay. Screw, screw, a, screw socket 939. I was like, what? No, don't screw socket 939. And they did, and they walked away. And I'm like, and then like AM2 was like five percent better. And it was like, you get, you got rid of the the awesome socket. And you went with the with something that you don't have like any performance benefits to. And then when I went from 939 directly to socket AM3, I went from like 15 frames a second in oblivion to like over 60 with the same video card. Uh, I think that was, yeah, that, uh, yeah, that was uh, the 8800 GTs. So anyway, so hardware gaming. Okay, I have been watching Husky StarCraft 2 videos, and I'm not really an RTS freak, but, you know, I, I, I'm, I'm probably going to cave in uh, and this week, probably go out and get a copy, even though... I absolutely have decided that I hate Activision, um, and a lot of people are like, Activision, StarCraft 2, blah, 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 I'm like, I just want to find these reporters, get the biggest trout I can find, just smack, it's, it's not an Activision game, and the fact that Activision is there kind of spoils it, because it's not a full game, and people are like, what do you mean it's not a full game, it's a full game, no, because in the full game, you get to play the campaigns for all three races, actually species. I, that's that's another thing. They're species. They're not races. And then you hear people say the human race. That's like, I can't think of a good analogy. But that's a complete misapplication. There are human races, and they compose of the human species. So don't you know? That's just another commie thing that the communists like to do, to help erode your identity. So hi commies. So anyway. But for all the awesome people, because commies can never be awesome, um, I am considering going on StarCraft 2. Now, can re, uh, I do not consider myself very likely to get onto the Platinum. Uh, and I am not, like, hard, hardcore gaming. Like, uh, if, if, you got, if any of you guys watch Husky videos, he is great. He doesn't swear, and he is kind of funny. And I, I really like uh, watching... The, the, the four versus four, just hilarious. <laughs> but, um, but yeah, um, so, um, but if any of you guys, um, when I do get StarCraft II, if any of you guys um, would like to teach me, because I know I'm going to suck, um, I will likely play the campaign for a little bit and kind of get comfortable with the units, but I am just not going to know how to counter um, 
and I'm more of a de defense. Yes, I kind of turtle. Yes, I admit it. Uh, I'm a I'm a big Terran fan. I also like the Protoss. I do not like the Zerg. Uh, <laughs> and one of the things I noticed about uh, on some of the uh, the maps when when Husky posts the videos is that the Zerg players really take over and dominate those maps. So um, so yeah. But anyway, so I'm not gonna go go too much into this. Um, I do have some new hardware besides the keyboard and mouse that I haven't told you guys about, but you guys would be like, why haven't you posted videos about that hardware? It's like, I really am trying to get this version of my site done, and I am like, literally, I mean, um, I'm finishing up a time zone issue, because you ever go to a site where the, you post at like 2 p.m., and it says you post at like, like 6.53 in the morning, or 11 o'clock at night, and you're like, what the hell is this crap? Alright, so I gotta deal with Oh, I gotta deal with so many issues because I'm building the platform from scratch. So I, you know, but I am slowly getting there. I have, I think, two more control panel related features that I absolutely positively have to get in there. But the time zone thing and the accounting, uh, the count stuff. So it is, what, it's the 13th. So hopefully I'll be in beta 1 before the end of the month. That is my goal. And hopefully I will have beta 2 the beginning of next month and that's when you guys will be in there and then that's when I'm gonna try to get more of the gaming and much more hardware related stuff um, and a quick glance on the, at the keyboard and mouse since now if okay I guess the stand itself will stay in there so here is the mouse actually let me get the uh, where is the flashlight there it is hidden alright so here's the mouse it is awesome the thing is though is here see if I can get all of this when I put my hand on it the, the scroll wheel no oh, the scroll wheel on um, the side scroll wheel, you have to kind of move your thumb it's not very comfortable um, I know the, the camera quality sucks here let me see if I can put it on the desk all right so yes yeah, so you have to kind of like it would be nice if you just lift your, your thumb a little bit but you gotta go all the way back here to effectively do that this button is kinda nice now this is a crappy two dollar Walmart whatever pad so I'm gonna get a, a gaming pad if you guys have any recommendations just after I post this video then go for it because I'm going to order on something on Newegg and it's like 3.30 in the morning right now so alright the keyboard um, just so you guys uh, can see here again I sorry about the the camera but I don't I just don't care you know what let me turn off the light and then show you the keyboard LEDs all right so here we go so I just I, I see here so there's let me kill off LCD for a second so there's red there's like purple and there's blue and I just hit my mic wonderful so anyway So yeah, so there's a lot of things going on, and we're kind of like building, you ever like, um, kind of like NVIDIA when, um, when I'm no longer going to buy NVIDIA cards, this flashlight doesn't shut off quickly, um, and they don't tell you anything, and then they kind of, once they actually get to a product release, everything just starts coming out of nowhere, that's kind of what um, I'm doing. <laughs> but anyway, um, so let me guys know if any of you uh, are interested in playing StarCraft 2 together. Um, that would be towards the end of this week, so that would probably be no. I I don't I don't think it'll be earlier than the 16th. Um, so because I still have to go up and buy the game and all that and money and all that. So, um, but yes. Yeah, so I really am that tempted to get StarCraft 2, and I will definitely be getting some gaming videos out there. I do have some um, some nice uh, hardware that I have acquired that I have not told you guys about and I'm sorry but I really gotta keep the work going because if I cut out now and start doing all these gaming videos then you guys aren't gonna be able to, to post on the forums and really uh, have that thing so uh, kind of getting it all together and then we'll move forward so trust me it's gonna be worth it in the long term anyway I don't know how much time so thanks for watching and I will definitely see you guys soon